a little rudder cable installation. Don't look too bad, right? <laughs> we'll see. Parts list right here for you. Here we've got them all. All the parts are right here, so. Except, uh, I've already lost the, uh, white plastic cable. Wow, I just had it. Here it is. Don't know how it got over here, but it belongs in this pile. There, now I think we have everything in the pile to complete the rudder pedals. I mean the rudder cables. Back to the rudder. Yeah. Hey, almost out of time. Almost out of time. Okay guys, we got the rudder pedals all in. Rudder pedals, yes we do. We have the rudder cables in also. Uh, we still have to glue in our plastic pieces here, our bushings where it slides through. We've got, uh, got one that needs slid back there. They get glued in position. Got the swedges here where the uh, co pilots cables hook in. I've still got to trim those off. But uh, the crossover there in the center, the uh, has still had to put the pins in on the wheels to keep the uh, cables from being able to come off of them. The pedals came out good, they are. They came out good. They're real good and straight. I do not have the uh, adjustable rudder pedals. That leaves you more room underneath here. I just didn't need them for my length. It was fine without them. So I decided not to get them. Got all the swedges in there. Hopefully they're all good. Uh, started on the seat tonight. I got it trimmed. Had to trim a lot of corners off. Have to trim the back off. You have to cut for seat belts, but I'm not going to do that till I get them out and see just exactly where they're going to run. Some say not to trim uh, where the book tells you to here, but I got to research a little more to see which way. Uh, these are just the seat frames. The seat, the seat actually goes in this. This is just a basket that holds the seat, basically. I've got to trim it a little more here for the control stick to fit. Uh, the rudder cables was quite a job. As you see, they work. The, uh, I actually have rudder control on the back back now. <laughs> Good to see some controls starting to move. That uh, gets you a little more excited about your building. Okay, I'll keep you posted. Uh, we got, oh, I did, I did have people set in here. You drill these from the back side on the tabs. There's tabs on the back here. You drill through, you're supposed to have it loaded. So I actually had two people set in here and that pulls this down, which you have to tr trim the fiberglass underneath here where it sits on the bar to get it to go down good onto the bar. But while they were sitting there, then I crawled underneath and cut the hose and uh, I'll show you that by the way because you rivet these on for the uh, bolts to go through. Other than that, well, hopefully we'll get these seats fastened down tonight, get, to, get those nut plates put in, they, they rivet in on the plates behind here. So I'll give you a shot of that when I get that done here in a few minutes. Okay, get back to work. By the way, when installing these, it was recommended that you put a clamp of two before on the front, like that, all the way across, and in your pedals you could uh, clamp against the two before, which were even with the firewall here. 
and that gave you something good and solid to pull in on the cables. You could t tighten them up good so that you could get everything swedged in the right position with a good tight cable. And that worked really good, so I just thought I would add that in here to help you guys out. I'm just going to show you how we do these nut plates here. Uh, they go on the back. But we stick a short bolt through them from the back side here. You have to put some washers on them so, so the bolt don't stick in your way. And then you've got a good pattern from this side to do your drilling. And after you get done drilling your holes, just take the, uh, take the bolt back out. There's the bolt with all the thick washers on it. And after you take it off, just put it back on on the back side where it rivets on. Put your what do they call it? Put your Clecos in there, just like that. And that one's ready to rivet on. <clears throat> you can put them on from the back side. On these two particular ones here, you can drill these from the back side, but they were open here and easy to show. When you get into down here in this area, you're not going to be able to drill from the back side, so you have to face drill them and then turn your nut plate back around. Put your rivets in there and you're good to go. Okay, we got them all drilled, they're all cleaned up, got them clecoed in. Uh, we already deburred them, so we're getting ready to start taking the clecos out and replacing them with rivets. Get this project finished up. That's all there is to it. Test fitting the seat belts. Got my co-pilot in the pilot seat today. <laughs> I heard her making plane noises a while ago, but we won't tell anybody. Checking the seat belt where we need to cut the hole. It has to it has to go through. We've kind of got it marked out there, I think, where it goes through the seat at now. So we'll give that a shot. Yeah, and grab the stick. Grab the stick and pull her up. <laughs> boo, 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 boo. <laughs> okay, we got the seat pans all bolted in. Everything fitting in there. I've still got to trim for the console. I've got how I have to trim here too. But we're going to wait till final finish to do that. Uh, there's nothing that I've found in the book about these. Any of you guys have these? Do they have hinges? Do they open and close? Leave me a comment. I haven't really seen anything in the book about them. All the, the older models just had a flat seat pan. I don't know when they started putting, putting these doors slash lids, whatever they are, on here. But a little storage compartment under there. But the book don't show anything about those so, that I've found. I may just not found the page yet, but I looked quite a bit on farther ahead and around the seat. So leave me a comment on those if you guys know. I think we're going to call it a night. <laughs>